Well, the story this spring for Ohio football has been the offense and defense really just going back and forth against one another. Well, today the defense got the last laugh in the annual spring game. The White ended up winning this game 16-7, to but the story of the day was the defense. Forced plenty of turnovers early and often. Great play by the defensive backs. That's a credit to them. And the linebackers and the D-line also did a great job of getting to the two quarterbacks, Tyler Tettleton and Darius Vick. So when it was all said and done, the defense was the story of this spring game. Tyler Tettleton was the starting quarterback for the green team today, and Darius Vick suited up for the white. Early first quarter, Tettleton with the pass, and that's picked off by redshirt freshman Brian Harrison. So the green lose the ball, but they'll gain it right back on this play here as Vick airs out a pass over the middle, and that will be met by the hands of safety Josh Kristoff, Pickerington Central's finest. Nice pick from Kristoff. So a slow start for both offenses, but here comes the green offense. Tettleton airs this one out, and this will be hauled in by Chase Cocker, looking to gain some more playing time this season. Down inside the 10, Vic steps in to play quarterback, but he will be sacked right here. The defensive line looked very good today. Matt Weller would tack on the field goal there. Three to nothing, white team. Here's Bo Blankenship for the green team. A nice 42-yard run down the right sideline. After the game, the Iowa State transfer gave all the credit to the guys blocking in front of him. I love the offensive line. They're great, and you know, I'm thankful to have them. Um, they make holes for us, and they do a, they do an absolutely great job. Green with the ball now in a scary moment as Tettleton's pass is deflected in the end zone, and that's a three-man collision. And after the play, this would be Aaron Macer down. He would not return. Now perhaps the start of the best offensive drive of the game. Tettleton to Mario Dovell for the green team down the right sideline. Very next play, Bo Blankenship will carry this one 22 yards down to the green nine. Big hit at the end of the play. Love to see that in spring ball, and that would set up a one-yard touchdown run from Ryan Boykin. So he'll punch this one in. Boykin and Blankenship both looking to get their plenty of carries this year. So that would make it 7-6 to six green. But the white defense continuing to step up. Devin Bass, look at that. Possibly the play of the game. Nice between two receivers to pick that one off. Quite a move of athleticism by Bass. And to put a cap on the game, Darius Vick finds walk on Art Jordan from one yard out. Here's Ohio coach Frank Solich afterwards. I thought uh, individually we had a lot of guys make a, make a lot of progress. And, and as a unit, uh, you, you know, you're never quite satisfied with, with that progress. But, but we did make some. We're going to need to uh, get some things done over the summer. And, and we're going to need to have a real good uh, fall camp. Well, that's it for spring workouts for Ohio football. The Cats will not take the field for an actual game until September 1st when they head to Happy Valley to take on the Penn State Nittany Lions. But plenty of work will take place between now and then, including fall workouts. So I'm sure Frank Solich and the Cats can't wait to get back on the field this fall. That's all I have for the Bobcats Sports Showcase. Have a great day. I'm Pat Chiesa.